Hello. Hello. What is poppin', Shalom. everyone? Shalo. 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 Hello. How's it going? Everyone? Probably pull up your chat too, actually. Oh yeah, wait. I need yeah. your chat too. This is awkward actually, because that just hit me. I, I didn't think about that mm. until now. I I, I have yeah. we we do we no, we don't collab. We did we didn't think this through. We didn't think this yeah. through. Hold it's, on, I gotta grab really it off cool. twitch.tv. We value your yeah. privacy. Twitch.tv twitch .tv slash ara ara Siggy. Actually, that's not even it. It's Siggy Ch why does it say you're playing Valorant? Oh god, I got an ad. <laughs> does it really? Oh shit. Oopsies. <laughs> Oopsies. I right. forgot because I was supposed to stream Valorant like the other night and I forgot. Ah, well that's a little bit awkward. Uh -huh. My bad. Oopsies. Okay, I don't even no, know no, how to no. pop out your chat window, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna leave it here. I'm I mean, just... I just leave it in another window. Don't care. Yep. Yep. Anyways, what's up, everyone? It's your boy. Your boys. <laughs> <laughs> Both of the boys? The, the, the boys? The boys? Yeah, it's the boys back at it again with our first ever official collab stream. Because every single time before, <laughs> it's just he walks into my room and we just start talking. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, all, I, all I do is open the door and then I laugh at him for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, so for those who don't know, this is my roommate, <laughs> Araki <laughs> Segi. <laughs> And they What's were roommates. Up? Yeah. And they were roommates. And they were roommates. Yeah. Uh, you want to say a little bit about yourself? Uh, there's not a lot to me, brother. We got we to gotta remember, all I do is one play FPS and talk for like three hours at a time. I mean, hey, that's what I do too. Minus the FPS plus... Come on, you you play Apex. You you had your Apex art. True, but they we don't we don't want the chat to know that I play like twelve hours a day on normal. Okay, well, mm, 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 sometimes, mm, sometimes I've I've gotten better about it. I think. Yeah, mm. but yeah, we're roommates. Hello. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> and we're VTubers. That's crazy. Yeah, it's actually crazy. Un unfortunately. Unfortunately, yeah. He has to deal with me <laughs> screaming my lungs out. It's like 2 in the morning. I'm like, guys, I learned this new mixed voice technique. Check this out. <laughs> and then he has to hear it. Is this the same it. roommate who laughed after hearing your mom voice while playing Pokemon? Yeah, that's me. My mom voice? <laughs> Yeah, your mom voice. I don't remember my mom voice. I you you were reading like a piece of dialogue and you're just you were like putting on a voice and I was like, what is that? I opened the door. <laughs> ah. Ah. It's all coming back to me now. Audio is glitching a bit sometimes by the way. Uh oh. I think I know what it is. I think it's my noise gate. Hold on. Oh, is it? No, it's not my noise gate. I think uh. I just suck. All right. Um, whose audio is glitching? Also, I should turn on BGM. I don't know. Ah, uh, well, well, it's me. <laughs> oh, oh man. Oh no. Oh no. This could be anything. This could be anything. Let's just take this off. Maybe that will sound better. I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully, this sounds okay. Well, anyways. Hello, everyone. Today, we are doing a tier list of the worst foods ever, supposedly according to tierlist.com. So, hope you guys are having a good time. Happy Thursday. Yeah. Bro, he's putting on, he's, he's doing his best. What's Mr. up, gamers? <laughs> What's up, gamers? It's me, Uzi Atomia. Back in again with another stream. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my god. Sorry. I just I have to do it. You have to do it. It's for it's for the montage. The montage. The montage. <laughs> In case anyone ever <laughs> clips every time Uzuki Tomoya does the gamer voice, they have it, right? It's like, oh, this stream he forgot to do the gamer voice. Oh no. This time he definitely now, has so the gamer voice. Oh, okay, okay. I got I got this. I got this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Here we go. Boys, today the plan is simple. Smash your pass on controversial foods. Now hear me out, hear me out. Pineapple, pickles, coconut, all sorts of different foods that we're going to compare today. Today! You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. All right, <laughs> all right, all right let's, just, let's just get going. Let's just go. <laughs> That's enough solid. All, right. <laughs> all right, what the heck is this first thing here? It looks like money. Have you, wait, have you, no, have you not had those like chocolate gold coins you get in like Halloween or like your grandma's house? St. Patrick's like, Day. Any other? 
Yeah. Is that a th wait? Do you wait? You know, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I've completely forgotten that like St. Patrick's Day existed. <laughs> I just had a traumatic elementary school experience when I was like five years old, and every time St. Patrick's Day came along, it was like, "All right, time to pinch someone." And if you didn't, and just like I don't know, someone was always role playing as a leprechaun, like one of the teachers. So for some reason, I associate the gold coins with the rainbow leprechauns and St. Patrick's Day. I thought you were gonna say you associated it with RP, but then. <laughs> You know, uh, hey, uh, you know, you know, you know, you do what you want. You know. teachers, it, like that's the impression you got from it. I'm not gonna stop you. It could be worth. Yeah, no, okay. Actually, wait, that's such a good RP idea. Actually, okay, though. but I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I actually like those coins a lot. What? I feel like they taste like nothing, and they're just thin. Well, it's just chocolate. You just, it's just like a snack. It's a small snack. You want something a little sweet, and it's like a gold little coin. You're like picking at it, and you're just like, oh, this is candy. But you don't even eat the gold part. You just take it off well, and throw it in the trash. Of course not. It's plastic. Well, actually, is it even plastic? It's like aluminum. It's like aluminum, aluminum, probably. It's not even real gold. Yeah, uh, for obvious is, reasons. It's still chocolate. Yeah, but like it's so thin and it's always like super washed out flavor. It's just like nothing. It tastes like nothing. You bite into it and you're like, okay, I see, I see all of you, you, you boys. I'm trying so hard not to curse. I see all of you <laughs> boys sitting here saying that the chocolate's mid. I'm telling you otherwise, I like it. That's a smash for me, I, boys. I think they're right. That's a pass. That chocolate is yeah, bad. Yeah, coins are fire, but not gonna <laughs> lie, I dislike taking off the ball. It's Fire. Okay, the foil part is fun, I think, but then the rest of it is so disappointing. It's like one thing after another, really. Cheap chocolate has a special taste. That's what I'm talking about. There's just something about them. Yeah, it's just especially bad. That's what it is. No, 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 no. no, no. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm a believer. You all guys right. can hate all you want. All right, all right. Agree to disagree. Agree to disagree. Fine, fine. Yeah. Okay, next one. Raisins. Let's hear your take on raisins. There is no take. I just don't like... We've been over... Okay, well, raisins are just dried out grapes. That's still fruit. But I don't like fruit. They're so. not really fruits because, like, a fruit you think about, like, you eat it usually so, so, raw, right? Okay, but what do you mean raw? That Raisins are raw, too. It's just no, dried out. No, people put stuff on raisins. They put, like, salt in it. They put it in sauces sometimes. They eat what? it with other foods. Like, What's raisin bread no, 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 cookies. No, 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 no. You... No, that doesn't that does not make any sense. What do you mean they put stuff in raisins? That doesn't make any they sense. They put stuff on raisins. That's what I meant to say. What do you mean put it on raisins? Have you, you never put had raisins on the food, not on the raisins. Have you never had trail mix before? That's just regular ass raisins. No, they in put, a bag. They put salt on them. <gasps> Have you never had oh, salted oh. raisins before? Pass. Pass. Smash. Raisins are bad. Bad. Smash. I don't like raisins. <sighs> so good. It's just that perfect Chocolate amount. Chocolate covered raisins? No, 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 no. I won't even what? give the pass for that one. What? Those hey, are no, good. No, no, no. You stand no. by shitty chocolate, but you'll smash yeah. raisins? You'll s uh, wait, Yeah. Are you pass I'll raisins. pass on raisins, but I'll take the coins. What the f even the chocolate covered, you could you could melt the yeah, same. You, you, hey, listen, it, this is this is the equivalent of like us going to like elementary school, and you know when they like give you the like the little school lunch, they give you like the little box of raisins with like the the, the sun with the face on it. Yeah, I'll, I'll throw that at you. Okay, and I'll eat it. I'll smash it. <laughs> like, that stuff's good. It's like it's like sweet, but not too sweet. It's better than the washed out shitty chocolate. That's for sure. Yeah, coins over raisins. Any day, all day. That's what I'm fucking talking about. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, this guy. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Anyway, sun made. Yeah, I think yeah. it's sun made. Sun made more like fire made because they're good. I always like them. All right, all right. Mustard. I, th I think mustard's pretty okay. I think it's like you know it goes well with things. I'm not gonna eat it like. I, but I'm not. I'm not crazy about like yellow mustard though. You know what I mean? There's, yellow yellow mustard is too sour. There's another kind of mustard? Well, there's like Dijon mustard, right? They're different? Yeah. Because <laughs> there's Dijon mustard and there's yellow mustard. Mustard is mustard to me, brother. <laughs> oh, yeah. Honey mustard. Honey mustard is also a thing. Oh, honey but, like, mustard honey is mustard, good. Honey mustard, Dijon mustard, that, okay. yellow mustard. There's all these different mustards. But like, I, th I think yellow mustard just sits at the bottom. It's just too... Rancid is not the right word, hmm. but like... 
pungent. It, it, it has like the horse radish burn type beat. You know yeah, I mean? without as much of the burn, so you don't actually enjoy it. You know, I yeah, like I I just I don't like yellow mustard. That's a pass I for me. I think it's okay. I literally have this exact same bottle in our fridge right now for sandwiches. Do we have that? I bought it. I bought it. Really? And I have the exact same mayonnaise too that's on here in our fridge. So Why I mix the two together. Slap it on a sandwich, take that to work, unless I forgot to buy sandwich stuff, and then boom. We gotta get you like the better stuff. I don't know. I don't know. Works or works. Who's food? I mean, but uh, but, but, bro, you can enjoy your food. I, I mean, I guess you're right. I, honestly, I just use it because it's there, to be completely honest. So, I mean, I like it mixing with other con No, even with what? Okay, actually, in okay, in maybe like some circumstances, I'll take. You going to like Costco and like you get it on a hot dog with like the ketchup, ketchup and mustard. That makes most sense to me. Mm -hmm. If you are a, a mustard only on a hot dog, I will think you're a freak. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. If we're going alone, I would never just eat mustard alone. You're right. This is a pass. I, I think mustard is alone pass. is weird. Yeah. That's worse than mayonnaise alone, which is also weird. <laughs> Love yourself, Tomo. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Uh, that's true. He is trying to guide me in the right direction. I'll I'll give it to him. We'll pass this one. Listen, I may take him out to like really bad fast food, but hey, honestly, that fast food's pretty good. We literally have had McDonald's like three days in a row this week. Uh, well, actually, yeah. <laughs> I, I was like, I was like, how are you? And then we mix in the occasional Taco Bell, McDonald's, or Taco no, Bell. Uh, Take we, your pick. We, we, yeah, we've had McDonald's, we've had Taco Bell, and we've had Little Caesar. <laughs> <laughs> well, we had a different burger last night, which was pretty good. True, true, pretty true. Pretty good, true. but like, yeah, it's one of the three. One of the three. <laughs> yeah, it is what it is. I mean, it, it's cheap. It's good. Where can you go wrong? Right? True, true. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what I had. Well, you know, I feel like the pizza is another discussion. We'll, okay. we'll, we'll hold that for later. We'll, we'll get that for there. Later, we'll I've, get there. I've had a whole spiel about this. <laughs> All right. All right. Almond um, Joy. <laughs> Smash. Is, is this the one with coconut? Yes. It has a coconut is, is that on what that it. Is? it. Look at the Joy. It has a, a okay, whole well, ass, no, no, half no, no, ass okay, coconut. No, because there, there's like there's like Almond Joys, and there's like another thing that's like oh, chocolate and mounds, coconut. You know what I mean? Mounds. Yeah. That, yeah, that, that's the one. That's the one. Mounds are good, too. I think they're both good. I, mm, I it's kind of a smash. Have you ever had like cold almond joy or like frozen almond joy? No, but the thing is, is like I just don't like coconut like at oh all. Oh my god! Anything that grows I'm, on a tree, anything that's I'm from a not plant. A fan, brother. God. Listen, hard pass, hard pass. That's oh what god. I'm saying. Sorry, <sighs> I don't do coconut. Smash! It's so good. The almonds, come on. The almonds got to counteract it a little bit, even though they sent me to the emergency room that one time. But still, I. I'm okay. I'm also not big on like nuts either. Like I'm not a big fan oh, of nuts either. Actually, God. now that we're really talking about it, anything that feeds you nutrition and vitamins, <laughs> yeah. you yeah, literally any, anything that is like nutritionally complete, I will reject. <laughs> it's literally chocolate. <laughs> Oh my yeah, not a god. nut guy. I'm not a nut guy. That's Ooh, what I'm saying. Oh my god, this man never with the nuts. Ugh. All right, no, no, no. unfortunate <sighs> whoppers. Wa I okay. Smash. This is this is a tough one because like smash. I I eat them begrudgingly if there's like no other snacks, but I don't think they're that bad. So yeah. I mean, smash. I guess it's not like the, yeah, it's not the top of the list. But it's pretty good, you know. You can get away with a few of them, but I couldn't yeah, eat them okay, all day. Okay, okay. The thing, the thing is, is like, yeah, whoppers are whoppers are mid. Yeah. But it's like, yeah. The malt does go hard, but also I can't eat a whole box by myself. You know what I mean? Right, right, right. That's where that's where I come in with smashing. Yeah, like, yeah. I, like I will, I will probably eat like maybe like a fourth of it at most. And yeah. I'll be like, okay, I don't need them anymore. I'll maybe have the other like half, but I mean, I won't devour. But it's still a smash from me. I'm not gonna pass it if it's there, you know. Add them to coffee. I've I've never thought to add whoppers to coffee, but also what? that does sound interesting. That does though. sound pretty good. Too bad we don't have coffee and we just drink diet soda here. Or you do. I drink normal soda. Yeah, I I drink diet soda only. Yeah. You guys might think I'm a freak because I don't consume normal because sugar you anymore. Are a freak. But hey, di diet sodas are are some are kind of fire, some are kind of dog. But I won't lie. True. Diet Coke has grown on me over the past like two years. It's not bad. It's not bad. I've had more recently. I'm. It's. I am no worse. longer a hater. <laughs> Be okay, but Coke Zero versus Diet Coke, where's the line? It's a tough one. I'm not gonna lie. I, I think Coke Zero. So the first, and, and we're gonna we're gonna have a history lesson real quick. Uh -huh. The first iteration of Coke Zero was fire. 
That was the perfect recipe. Okay. And then suddenly along the and you'll notice that like there at some point in time they changed the packaging, and that's how you know it changed. They switch. <sighs> okay. True. True. That that second formula of like or of like it's like the black and red label. Or no, no. So like the primary color was black and then it had red accents. That's the one. Right. Like the black cans. Uh -huh. And then they changed it to what it is now, mm -hmm. where it's like a red can with black letters, right? Right, right. Now that that like version of Coke Zero is just not the same. It's kind of trash. I'm gonna be honest. I don't like it, but I drink it begrudgingly if I don't have another choice. So Diet but, Coke. Di yeah. So Diet Coke has like like risen up in the ranks ever since they changed the they they switched. That's all I'm saying. I think Coke switched, and I I am now a Diet Coke lover. The grass was greener on the other side, I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. That honestly, that's fair enough. I can respect that. Yeah, I'm yeah. a hater now, though. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's all right, but, like, I'm always a hater. Yeah, that's fair enough. I haven't had enough exposure to diet sodas to really be like, hmm. Mm. But whoa, whoa, when it's there... Pepsi better than Coke 100%? Mm. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Mm. I'm not... We're not... We're, we'll, I'll get back to you later. Mm. Okay, actually, <laughs> I had a Pepsi phase. I did, like... But we'll get back to that. We'll get back to that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, warheads. I think I, these are good. I, love I, I like warheads. Smash. I'm, I'm smashing them. Okay, I will say. Now there is a brand, and I don't know if, if our gym bro has talked about this before. Uh huh. But you, there is a brand of like energy drinks and like pre workout that we really like. Oh, uh huh. And they have they have like warhead flavored like pre workout and like energy drinks. Oh. And recently on one of my drives. Oh. I picked up the the like the warhead like energy drink. Okay. That shit's crazy. Oh, that's good. Okay. It's really good. It's not like it's not like it's gonna like like destroy the back of your throat, uh -huh. but it tastes like the it like just the flavor concentrated into juice and it's amazing. And it, it's not like you feel like your tongue is gonna turn into a raisin. Yeah, mm -hmm. like it's just good. Is it ghost energy? Yes. Oh. Uh, I just didn't want to say the brand because we're not shills. No. Because uh it, very ghost clearly they're not gonna pay me. Ghost I'm energy please it. sponsor us if you're checking this stream out on YouTube, on Twitch, be sure to leave a like, comment, and send an email. We'll definitely get back to you. Anyways, <laughs> smash. Um Thin Mints. Smash. I mean, it's a smash, but like, I'm I'm not gonna lie. I, like, I want to say in the last like two three years, they have slowly fallen down the ranks for me. But mm. this is also mm. because I just don't like as much sugar and chocolate as I used to. Uh, you have because it's point. before. Before it's like I would be able to just finish a box on my own, like right. no problem. Right. Whatever. I don't care. I'll I'll pull out a bag. I'll just be eating it, and next thing you know, like two hours later, it's gone. So I'm like. That, and now, now it's like I can barely eat maybe like four or five and be like, I'm good, you know? You know, yeah. I mean, also, I feel like it also, it's like, it has to do with when you're introduced to them, right? Like, you're introduced to Thin Mints at a fairly young age, usually, just conditioning-wise. So it's like, when you're Wait, plethora, really? I feel like, I don't know, I was like five when I first had like Thin Mints and Girl Scout whoa, cookies. Whoa, 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 I didn't even have these until like, what, like, maybe like end of middle school. That's crazy. Wait, what? Oh my gosh, yeah. no. Oh my god, no, these are, like, I, I was conditioned, like, when my plate was small of things that were available to eat and things I knew I liked, Thin Mints were at the top because it's like there wasn't any other competition. But then as you get to like, no other chocolates and other things, like, you know, like, steak, Almond Joy, raisins, like the Thin Mints just Wait, move wh down a little bit, just because okay, there's more hold on, options. Hold on, hold on. Why, why did why did you say why did you, why, why did you say when you get to know other chocolates and then you said steak? What the <laughs> fuck do you mean steak? You know, what are you talking about? <laughs> you know, I lost my train of thought halfway through. I thought I said foods, but chocolate came out my mouth because I was thinking like I was looking at the Whoppers and the Almond Joy, and I said chocolate but i was thinking steak and i'm like yeah i was i was gonna be like that something's not adding up something. here one of these things is not like the <laughs> one of these is not like the others i have this problem where i just i see something and i say something entirely different and i i realize too late and i swear to god i hope the other person didn't mishear me or they just look at me weird and don't think i'm weird Hey man, yeah. I, I have to pay attention to these things. We're literally two people in a room at that's, this point. That's true. Yeah, I, it just comes out. I mean, if you now that you know, you're gonna see it more often. Now that you've seen it. Oh boy. Yeah, it's like I'll say like, oh my god, that like fish was so good, and it's literally like a tomato or something. And I'm like, fuck. What? I don't know. No, I swear. Like it's All like. Right. 
I. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It's like you, you, you can be words. as delusional as you want to be. I won't stop you. Okay, okay. Anyways, Thin Mints. As I was saying, like as I, you, I think Thin Mints are smash. Yeah, I, it's a smash, but like mid smash. You know, not like hard smash. Just like, you know, it's good enough. It's it's never bad. You know, you're never gonna it's, bite it's one. It's definitely be like falling down the ranks, but I I won't say no to it. Right, right. It's still a solid like. You know, I'll eat two or three of these if I'm starving and I, I feel great afterwards. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, <sighs> anyways, um, beets. Gotta say, I mean, I am a proponent of vegetables, but but are, are you passing on on beets? I I think I'm gonna pass on beets. I gotta, I gotta. Like, okay, I'm I'm not gonna lie. I, I grew up with a lot of beets, and also I've there's, had beets just done really well. There's no I'm way. I'm not gonna lie. No, no, this is for me at least. I'm I'm not gonna lie, dude. The, like, the, I would smash beets, dude. Dude, the first vegetable of the list. Yeah, it is. No, <laughs> no way. I don't even know who I'm talking to anymore. What? Dude, I'm I'm listen, listen. Uh, growing up, it was fine. Growing like doing it myself, it's fine. <sighs> Going to restaurants, they do it pretty good. I've just never had a bad experience with beets so far. What? Okay, but like, what do you like about them? I can just do whatever the hell I want with them. <laughs> but <laughs> like, it. I feel like they're just like they don't have any flavor. They're just kind of like. But that's the thing, right? It's like they don't have a lot of flavor, but at the same time, like they just take up flavor from other things. And it's great. You make, you make, put them in soup. They get, they absorb everything, and they're just little chunks of flavor. I, and then, like, if you put them in like any other dish, it's like, oh damn, the, like these random ass veggies in like a steak plate. This is pretty good. They soak up the the steak juice. It's pretty good. I mean, it's just hard pieces of steak that don't have the texture of steak. It's just not the same. I don't know. I don't know. I I th yeah. Be well. Beats with a lot of acidity is awesome. That's what I, I agree with that one, actually. Hmm. I think when they also have like a little bit of tang to them, it's pretty good. <sighs> agree to disagree, but I'm passing on that one. You can have all I'm, the ones I'm to smash. Taking, I'm taking beets, brother. Mm, mm, mm -hmm. Beet sugar? Wait, beet sugar I, is a thing? I don't know about beet I don't know what that is, actually. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no comment on that front. There. Did we get another Seggy during the break? Uh, yeah, I, I'm S Seggy version 2. I've, I've killed the original, and I've taken his place. No, that's not true, I'm, because he still no passes on... Vegetable he passes on everything else. I swear to God, if you, pa if you smash a single other vegetable on this list, I will be convinced, but for now... Fair enough. For now. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright, sardines... Is it sardines or anchovies? Is, is we gotta I, actually are they the same thing? I don't even know. I was about to say there's Wait, a okay. difference. Hold up. Hold on. Are Wait. anchovies and sardines the same? I mean, sardines are the can, but like they're entirely different species. Okay, <laughs> never mind. They're entirely different. Oh, okay. But how can I tell what this is if I mouse okay, over? Okay, for the it? sake of this photo, I'm assuming that these are sardines because they're longer. Aren't and they? Apparently, anchovies are like tiny. Oh, okay. Aren't they like this? Okay, um, they're not the same. Well, same Fair flavor though, right? It's like fishy and kind of salty. Yeah, I'm assuming it's like also anchovy spice. Okay, well, either way, sardines. Okay, there was a period of time when I was when I moved back home for a little bit. Uh -huh. When I was back in SoCal, I I had this <laughs> uh -huh. this time where I just I I don't like one and broke two. I'm like I don't like where this is going. I gotta eat something, bro. <laughs> oh no! Oh, don't tell me. So I we used to have the, like the, the little like peel cans, you know what I mean? You get you, you get you peel it open, you you have a fork, no, you like mix no. them around a little bit. They're no, like they're no. they're just they're stored in like olive oil. Oh no! Don't okay? do it! Don't you, do you, it! You put that you you get that you get a bottle of ponzu and a bowl of rice and you just go to town, baby. Mm. I'm telling you, that's a smash oh. in my book. Oh god. oh god! I wouldn't I even say mid smash. I would say it's pretty good. Okay. Okay. There. Okay. I gotta. Okay. Uh, hey, listen. You for for those of you who were all the way back when I first started streaming, I was still eating that when I was streaming. What the hell? Okay. This is back in 2020. This dude. is a little much. This is a little much. I did not need that no, much dude, imagery. This is okay. that is. 
This is what we call the flavor bomb, all right? Mm, bad flavor bomb. That's what I have to say. I'd smash bomb. raisins over these. Oh, God. Oh, I just They're just so salty and fishy. I, by the way, I hate but fish. But that's why you but eat like, it with rice. Oh, I yeah, hate, you do hate fish. I, I do hate about fish. That yeah, I hate fish. They like just so like flaky and then or like weird. I don't know. It's just not good. I feel like you just haven't had good fish, but honestly... I mean, would you call whatever the hell these are good fish? These aren't good fish. No, by no means. This is a poverty I, meal, but honestly, is, hey, it's pretty good poverty uh, meal. Okay, yeah, well... <laughs> Fine, I'll give it. I'll give it a shot. Maybe I just haven't had good sardines or whatever. I don't know. To be honest, I've actually probably never even had them before, but I just think they're weird. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Well, all right, all right, chats. Both chats be holding to this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay. One day, one day we're gonna eat a bunch of these foods on this list. Oh God. One day. Next week. Not next week. Not next week. That's oh too soon. God. I need like a week to recover from this. Anyways, blue cheese smash. Oh, so good. Smash. Smo smash. So we, we good. We had blue cheese the other day. Mm. Pretty good. Mm. Just pretty mm. good. It's just like the extra flavor bomb. It's so unique. Oh, it's just perfect on like, I think I had it on like steak one time. It was really good. What? What? It, trust me. <laughs> trust me. It's like a curveball. On ball. steak? Yeah. It's like you get the savoriness with like that that what? twinge of sourness. It's just a good like one two punch when you're when you're I've, eating it. I don't think I've ever heard of blue cheese on steak because it's, it's like the only good. time there's like blue cheese anywhere is like when you go to like Wingstop or you go to like any wing place, Wingstop. they offer you like, you want huh? ranch or blue cheese and you usually get the blue cheese because mm. that's the one you're supposed to go with. That's, I mean, that's fair enough. I usually, salads, I grew up with it on salads, but then like one place I went to threw it on a steak and I was like, this is pretty good. I, this is pretty good. I'm a changed man, so. I just uh, never heard of that before. That's. I, I don't know. We gotta I'm, give it I'm a try. I'm curious. I'm curious, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. In a calzone, but I'm allergic to mold, so I can't have it too much. How do you? What? What, what does that mean? Wait, there's a lot to unpack on this one. Yeah, wait, yeah, wait, because, wait, because it's wait. Like, I can understand it being in a calzone, but also I'm just more confused. How? Like, are you allergic to like all molds? fungus in 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 excess? I, I, I'm assuming that anybody would react like poorly to like fungus in excess, right? Right, but right. Do you have like some like adverse effect to it like immediately? Right, like do you? Dude, I mean, clearly not, because they can have a little bit, right? Alternatively, alternatively, when you say allergic, does this mean that you are just having, like, do, do you get, like, the shits after, to which could potentially just be you being lactose? Or, the swell up, I'm gonna die. Good question. I don't I don't know if we, we want to go, go too personal on this one, though. Yeah, we, we, got, we got a lot of questions. Yeah, there's a lot of <laughs> questions here, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not man. bad, or right? Okay, okay. Okay, that, Rash that clearly sense. allergic. That's that's definitely not lacking the yeah, toes. Yeah, that's, that's, that's different. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Definitely don't want to go down that route. That that kind of sucks. All right. Um, Brussels sprouts. Honestly, I think that's, I, okay. I, I've had some pretty good Brussels sprouts. I'm not going to lie. I not. I'm... <laughs> I had okay. Ooh. I've had it good. I haven't done well once. Uh huh. Uh huh. But like maybe like eighty percent of the time, mid. Okay, you're not wrong. It's when it's done right with like the the vinegar and olive oil and like baked. That's when it's good. But any other variation is a pass. But I will make an exception <laughs> because that one variation is good. I will. Sprouts say. can be good grilled only mid smash. Okay. Yeah, it's not a hard smash. Do I do I do I give it a smash? Do I give it a smash for the sake that it was good once, hmm. or do I oh, do I say pass because majority of my experiences have been bad? I mean, right? It's a tough one, right? I, I honestly, I'm in the same boat, but I feel like I have to smash it because I've had it good enough times, and it's easy to make if you do do it. So it's so it's so difficult because it's like the thing is it's like i'm having i've had this similar experience with like zucchini actually well, zucchini's right? good because it's like, like well zucchini for me it's like i never went out of my way to get zucchini before you know until enough. recently mm -hmm. where you know i i started eating it more uh -huh. and i was like oh okay this is actually isn't that bad uh -huh, and i just uh -huh. kept doing it and so far I, my positive experience with zucchini so far has outweighed every bad experience you know so it's like yeah. now my opinion's changed but that's not the case with brussels sprout you know what hmm. i mean it's like it needs to have 
It's got to have a fucking resume. You know what I mean? It has to have a track record. You thing. know. And so far, it's just let me down. The one night, the one night smash isn't going to be enough. It's got to be, it's got to be yeah, like, like, you, you, you know, you got to really wow me. I'm sorry. Mm. You got to have me coming back again and again. That's, that's fair. That's fair. It's not worth taking a chance, right? If you saw it on the menu, yeah, you um, wouldn't take the chance. Yeah, okay, no. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You know, agree to disagree, but maybe... Maybe you can change your mind. Maybe I can fix you. I don't know. <laughs> I, I can fix him. <laughs> Chat, I can fix him. <laughs> I can get him to like vegetables. <laughs> God. Okay. Speaking of vegetables, pickles smash. I love yeah. pickles. I get pickles all yeah. the time. I, ha I have a jar in the fridge at all <sighs> times. I love you pickles. Do? No wonder I can't pickles. fit anything in the fridge. Yeah, pickles are my favorite, like like snack because they're like zero cal. They're they are. they're just good. They're sour. They taste like dill. It's so easy to make. I you make pickles, pickles? Are based. What? I mean, you can make pickles. Oh, okay. I just, I'm too lazy to do it, so I buy them. You know that's but, like you fair can make enough. pickles. They're pretty good. Oh, okay. Shit. Okay. That that's pretty good. That's a that's a smash I for me love though. Love pickles. Yeah. Same reason pickles just they always hit. Like. I remember my first time biting into a pickle and I was like, man, this is good. Like, this is so much flavor with like the perfect texture and like the sogginess is just like, mmm, with the crunch. Oh, just overwhelming goodness. I, it's always good. I, I, I love pickles, but alternatively, it's like, there's like an innate fear within me that anytime like I'm, I'm like eating pickles by itself, uh -huh. but like on an empty stomach. I am so afraid. There, there's this like Ooh. this legendary like a green tech story from like 4chan. Oh, oh, where it's oh, like, uh huh. Oh my god! It, it basically this dude, the like the, the vinegar, uh, like burned a hole in oh. him essentially. Oh. oh, and it's like it's terrifying because I'm like, oh, will that happen to me if I eat too many pickles? Ooh. I mean, I feel the same way. Have you heard the stories about the Haribo sugar-free gummy bears? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's like, <laughs> I'm too scared to eat anything in excess anymore. Uh, honestly, probably for the better. Honestly, the only thing we eat in excess is McDonald's. Uh, hee hee. Which is probably the worst thing to eat in excess, actually. Well, but. well, in comparison, like, I'm, I'm cool with being a little unhealthy in that sense. But at least it's not going to kill me. That's true. Well, it could, but not in the same way. Softly. Not in the same way. <laughs> 30 years <laughs> yeah i mean the question is like to kill you from to die from food is like a relative statement because i mean like obviously like everything adds up eventually and uh, i mean I, we, okay but we can say that about anything that, that's okay that, that's just becoming too general that's that true so. that's true yeah as I mean, long as you don't drink straight out of the jar you'll be well, okay. Come but on. I mean, it's pretty I, good. Like when you, it's I, like the I, juice, I, right? I like pickle juice. It's okay. pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. You, you guys can think I'm weird all you want, but I like pickles. Yeah. They're pretty good. They're pretty good. Anyways, white chocolate. That's a smash. Is that cheese or white chocolate? I actually can't tell. Like it's not bad. Uh, that's white chocolate, but but white chocolate sits in a weird spot because uh -huh. like it's just too sweet in my opinion uh-huh it, right. it gets really bad really fast i'm gonna be real I you mean, know what i mean like I, okay it, it definitely hits a point where it's like if i eat too much at one time i will i oh. cannot eat anything else because everything else tastes like nothing oh after that. okay you know what I mean? that's fair but you'll still have those first few pieces right it's like smash but can't keep going you know yeah I'll, I'll eat maybe like one you know you get you get like a full bar and like it, the, the hershey's one they break it they snap it a little pieces right i'll right. take like maybe like two one or two you know what i mean yeah i was yeah, gonna yeah, say yeah. three but then i was like no and actually thinking maybe about not it, no. three yeah but like also if you look at the picture it is chopped up into smaller pieces so if we're evaluating <sighs> off the picture definitely smash I, off I'm, of that like I'm a few pieces on mine. i'm not going mm, I'm okay well i'll go for three pieces and that's my threshold that's my threshold but arguably it is pretty sweet i can't go go on for too much longer you know it's like but like consider that you're not gonna eat a whole like loaf of blue cheese are you well no not not in capacity but at the same time it's like uh, cho chocolate is is kind of it's like standalone mm. I, I think it's in the case of like Blue cheese in context, yeah, sure. Right, you right. Wouldn't go, you wouldn't eat a full mm. block of blue cheese by itself. But right. at the same time, it's like chocolate is 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 that 
because you would do that. You know what I mean? Yeah, you actually do have a good point. We're not like we're we're keeping things in context. You know, it's not just the pictures, right? I mean, okay, but consider white chocolate on other things, like like white chocolate covered like. I was gonna say almonds or raisins, but those are two things you also will pass on. So, <laughs> white chocolate over something else that's good, you know? Uh, mm, I mean, it's like mm, white chocolate in the actually, coins. Actually, no. Actually, no. So, so I wouldn't even like it, even if it was like you know the uh, the the Valentine's Day deal, so, like uh -huh. like white chocolate covered strawberry. You know what uh -huh, I mean? Like, uh -huh. like even those, I wouldn't even do it. <sighs> okay. Because what happens is it's like. The white chocolate is super super sweet. The 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 strawberry or like fruit is super super sweet. Uh -huh. Those two at the same time are is just assaulting your mouth. And at that point in time, if you eat any more than maybe like one or two of them, you just don't taste anything anymore. Okay, that's fair. And that that's what frustrates me because it's like I would like to enjoy it more, but if I can't, then it's like what's the point? Yeah, that's fair. I mean, I was thinking more something on the savory side where they complement. But I mean, if you're thinking strawberry for plus plus white chocolate, I'm also a pass there. But like almonds, yeah, as long as it's not sweet on sweet, that's kind of like redundant. But if it's sweet against something else, I think it works. I don't know. But the real question is, would you eat it if it was in the coins? In the coins, yeah, probably. Okay. There's your answer. Two coins. Two coins. two coins. Okay. Okay. Still on the two coin limit. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Two coins. Two okay. coin limit. Fair enough. White chocolate covered bacon. I'm sorry, but what is wrong with you? Okay. That's a little weird. That's a little weird. That's a, yeah. I don't know about on bacon. What? What's the oil going to do that? Um, is that a thing? That sounds like, well, it, it sounds interesting. I'm not going to lie. Uh, not interesting enough. Because it's like, it, you, you'd you kind of expect, like, the sugar to complement the fat. I mean, but also, like, that that's kind of the purpose of, like, candied bacon. I don't know if you've had that before. No, I haven't. That, okay. You know, you, yeah, you so, so like, the really, like, savory fat with the sweet chocolate is, like, something that's meant to complement each other. Oh, okay. but also, I've just never had, like, white chocolate necessarily. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how that behaves, like, with the chocolate, whatchamacallits, yeah. Oh, white chocolate covered on pretzels. Now, that's good, I think. That's pretty mm, good. I, I, no, I, okay, so I agree, but also I think milk chocolate on pretzels is, is much more peak. Really? I, I, oh. I wouldn't do white chocolate. I'm gonna be honest. Interesting. Okay. My I I feel like milk chocolate on pretzels is like it's too milky, you know. I just I don't know. I feel like I just something short and sweet on top of the pretzel is is where it's at. But I'll do both uh, I I would do both, but I'd still prefer milk chocolate. I think that's my bottom line. You know what uh, I mean? Like uh, I it's it's just not it's it's not gonna go crazy. Yeah, yeah. It's still a smash for me. Still a smash. It's staying at the bottom. Okay. 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 You do you. All right. Um, coconuts. <laughs> no. What? Okay. Wait. What? Coconuts. Sorry, I, I gotta read. Oh. Oh. So, oh let's coconuts. Go. Uh, I. <sighs> it, it's a hard one. It's, it's a hard it's one. It's hard, right? Like, I. I just don't have many things that are have been really good with coconut, except right. except oh? in some drinks lately. Oh, right, right. some right. drinks you be, because there's that one place that we always go order from. That's true. And they've been doing that's they've true. been doing pretty good. Right, right. But also, like that's not in context, right? This is just normally when you have coconut. No, 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 no. You you cannot you cannot tell me that you are just getting a coconut by itself and just eating that like I mean, by itself. Some people do that. I watched a YouTube video where a guy I know like, people do that, but would you? I I mean no, but like I, they have those coconuts where they just put the straw into it and you drink the coconut milk and coconut oil. There's so many coconut products like I don't know. People do that. People who actually like coconut will be like, "Oh yeah, I use coconut milk and I, I use coconut I, oil." I, I'm a hater. I you like, got you guys. You guys can flame me all you want, but I'm a coconut hater. Honestly, yeah, I, I'm passing. I I don't think I like it enough to really smash. It's like okay, like in almond joys, it's okay, but but I'm not gonna drink a coconut milk thingy. I'm just I just not. I'd rather just go for real milk or something like. Like, like the the drinks have changed me, but alternatively, I I dislike coconut, I like coconut shavings. I like dislike coconut right. flesh. I just I don't like coconut it's not great. as like an ingredient necessarily, but I will like drink it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. So so that that 
that is that that will get a smash, but otherwise it's a pass. Right. But in this context, I will put it as a pass. Right. Because uh, they don't pure have to drink juice. On there. I will drink though. Pure juice. I will drink. Oh. That, that, oh. We, we count that. Oh. Oh. Okay. In interesting. I. Okay. Wow. You're more of a smasher than me in that case. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, that right reminds me of this like one movie I watched. You know that one channel, Chubby Emu, that just has like the. No, what the? <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, you don't? Oh my god, I get recommended no, these videos. I've, I've never heard all of the time. What is Chubby Emu? Oh, and also, are you? Uh, what? Okay. This is, this is the science man. Okay. 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 This is so. He's an. He's like a doctor, an MD, and he like he just. Talks about these medical cases and studies and stuff like it like in yeah. a story format. And he's like so and so, um, JC is presenting the emergency room with mitochondrial aflichio diagnog diarygenosis. Mitochondrial okay, meaning mitochondria. <laughs> I, I pulled Osis. open his channel. <laughs> I pulled open his channel, right? <laughs> well you're on your Twitter showing. <laughs> I know my Twitter channel. Like I, I, pull, I pulled up a chat. I pulled up his channel. Uh huh. <laughs> so you see, all like all of these are just like science videos, science videos. Right, right. If you, if you scroll down far enough, there's just pictures of him. There's just a lot of him about his, <laughs> his fat loss journey. And then there's the wait, there's but a it, leafy here for a second too. It's kind of inspirational though. It's kind of inspirational. What is that video? This, this is Enter the Gungeon! <laughs> <laughs> okay, but you gotta respect that he had the balls to keep it up he when he a, completely he changed his gamer. branding. I mean... He was a gamer through and through. I mean... And then he became a <laughs> fucking nerd! I mean, you go to your, your game, you get the good grades, you become a doctor, and you realize gaming doesn't pay the bills, <laughs> but being a doctor does. It makes sense. All I'm saying is... He switched. Yeah. Okay. But anyways, he, he had this. Switched. He had this one video where this guy was drinking like he drank out of like a coconut that he left out on the counter for like I don't know. It was either a, a week or a month or something, and he caught like mm. this virus, or not even virus. There's like some like fungi in it, and it like infected him and killed him in like a day. And he was like, "What? Yeah. The, hell? I, the medical stories are crazy. They're like so interesting." We gotta watch some later. It's like it's actually so good, <laughs> but like okay. Anyways, I, ever since then I'm like scared of coconuts. Like, why would you eat a coconut left out for a week? I agree. Why? Well, why? I think anything left out for more than like three days is already bad. I'm I, sorry, he, dude. He did say refrigerate on it. I mean, he tried to spit it out as soon as he noticed it tasted weird, but like just a little bit was enough to kill the man. And it was like, yeah, wow. uh, no, we're not taking a risk yeah. there, brother. Like that's. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so pass. Hard, hard pass for me. Yeah, hard pass, yeah, dude. Yeah, I've been traumatized. Yeah. All right. All right. The, the, only the real ones know. Only the real ones know. Yep. Yep. This yep. Is what, this is what we call poverty meals, oh, baby. Yeah. <laughs> I actually haven't had that much spam, but like, it's it's good. Whenever I have it, it's good. It's it's fire. Dude, it's like spam. Spam is a smash through and through. Smash it is literally smash. the savior. It saves lives. It saves households. Cure like like it solves world hunger. True. True. I'll probably kill the man. True. True. Probably that works out. I don't really care. I'll still eat it. It's good. I mean, it's like similar to pickles. It has like that perfect saltiness to it, and it's like it's just. The texture's there. I try not to think of what it's made out of, and it and it's great. It goes with so many things. It's just like pickles. Actually, I don't, what is spam made of? Spam. I don't. I, what, what I don't want to know. Spam made of. <laughs> you can stop there. You can stop there. I think it's made out of things that it's probably like the way hamburgers are made. I don't want to think about it's it. It's just it's just pork with ham meat. Wait, but it's just one block. But it's like ground up and like processed into it, right? Well. I bet I guess it's, it's not like, a lot to it, dude. I, I guess it's not that bad. Huh. It's literally just a a ham brick. But then how does it get that flavor? Just lots of salt. I mean, there's uh salt, water, potato starch, sugar, and sodium nitrate, which I don't even know what. Sorry, I I I, I, I will tell you right now. I got a C in uh, in college and high school chemistry, so I don't even know what that means. I have a degree in chemistry. I still don't know what that means. But I heard nitrates are bad for you. But that is, you know what? Spam is good for you. It's good for the heart. So there you go. The soul, maybe not the heart, actually, but y you know. 
Is it healthy? No. Is it tasty? Yes. yes. All right. You know what? That's all I That's need. a smash. That's all Chung, I need to know. We're not talking about like, are we going to smash this and live long? No. You smash, right? It's just, it, it is what it is, right? All right. Easy peasy. Yeah. Now, Oreos. Is this only the double stuff or I, I think in this context, it's double stuff. I don't think I've had the double stuffs, to be honest. But I've never been no, in Oreos. No, we fan. have. We have. We have? Yeah. I, I mean, if it's there, I'll eat it, but I'm not going to willingly smash, you know. I, I, it's, <sighs> I'm, I'm going to pass only because it's double stuff. But at mm. the same time, like, like the thing being is like, I will eat Oreos. Oreos are fine. You right. Know what I mean? Right. I'll, right. I'm, I'm cool with it. Just the double stuff is too much, dude. Mm, you know, you have a point. Yeah. I actually, it's like, yeah. it's like that much cream is just so much sugar and it it's it falls in the same category of like me not liking the like the the white chocolate solely because it's like i will not be able to taste literally anything mm -hmm. yeah it's it's a little much it's a little much i gotta pass i mean i've never been a big oreo fan to be honest growing up i was like i'd always turn down the oreos because I, I don't know i just thought like the the crust you know is just so like there's so much of it the it's crust? like what are they what are they called like the crackers i don't know they're, they're, what do you mean? What are they called? They're just cookies. Oh. That's what it is. The Oreo cookie. <laughs> no. What? But like. What did you think they were? But they're kind of like crackers. But no, they're they're called Oreo cookies. But like, but like the 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 cookie is like the whole treat. But like just like the crust of it isn't like it, it's like crunch. It's too crunchy to be like a normal cookie. It's too no, hard. What? No, 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 no. You take that back what? because there, there literally is crunchy cookies. Those are also a thing. What? What? What is a crunchy you, cookie? You, you mean to tell me? Like, like, say for example, you get like a, a crunchy cookie. Like you like. Uh huh. Like what, what the hell? What the hell they call? What the hell they call? Like uh, do, you, do you remember the? What's that one cookie brand? Uh, the <sighs> Chips Ahoy? No, those aren't crunchy. Th thin, th not not. It, no, it is Chips Ahoy. No, yes, they are. They are. They are. Chips Ahoy's are crunchy. But but it's not like the same. They're, like like this is like you snap it in half. Like and it no, like breaks. Anything, like like a cracker. If anything, the, no, if anything, the Chips Ahoy ones are even crunchier than Oreos. But like, like quite literally. But they're in a different shape. It has like the dough and it has the chocolate chip. No. But like the. What do you mean? They're both cookies. But it's the same thing. I mean, is the Oreo cookie made? out of like dough like normal cookies oh. is it like what is that thing made out of it feels and like resembles more of like two crackers smacked together with something in between all right all right i'm i'm, I'm gonna leave this up to both chats both chats we need we need to establish okay we all understand that these are cookies these are not crackers. okay okay i'm putting in a vote <laughs> i'm making a poll i'm making a poll here uh, all right uh, okay fine fine We'll, we'll do that. Is we'll do that. the Oreo the, the black Oreos part cookies or crackers of the Oreo cookie cracker? A, wait, I spelled Oreo wrong. This is stupid. Oreo a cookie or cracker? This is up for two minutes. You you crust, right, go go go. Crust or cookie? Ask your community. I it's it, there's. I, I need I don't think I even need to explain. All right, cracker. I'm voting. Why is it only me? What the hell? Why is everyone uh, 100 percent cookie? Uh, boy, I wonder why. What do you mean? Okay, finally, someone else says cracker or crust. I'm not alone in this world. <laughs> what? What? They, thank you to the eight of you who said this is stupid because thank you we've established that this is just there a cookie. There are four people much. in your chat who think it's a cookie. Actually, three because I voted cookie. Wait, no, fuck. I said cracker. Wait. Ah! <laughs> we got him, boys. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. Two people have said cracker in my thing, so... Uh -huh. uh, slash crust. You, I've thrown in crust there. Basically, cookie okay, or not now, a cookie. I, you said you have two people on your side out of the 24. I mean, I'm just saying I'm not alone, but uh, okay. Okay. I, uh, Minty, I voted cracker for pity. <laughs> oh. What? What? 
No! No! So you, you can't do me, me you like have, this. You have a one genuine vote. Even, you have a one even pity my vote. And, <laughs> you have 27 total votes. Oh, come on. Someone out there, please. Please. Come on. It's what makes it a cookie. On what grounds is it a cookie? By what other freestanding definition of a cookie does an Oreo crust be just a cookie. I, I literally don't even need to explain any of this because that we've it's it's just a cookie. And then somebody would give you five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for the five dollars. Tomo, what? Toma, what the fuck? How are Oreos not cookies? It's a sandwich cookie on the. Okay, do you call bread a sandwich? No, that's just. Bread and then put two breads and the stuff in between and that becomes a sandwich. Do you put the Oreo crust, the Oreo crust, the filling, or each of those individually cookies? No! You have your Oreo crust, your filling, and then your Oreo crust. Boom! You make an Oreo cookie. It doesn't mean the constituents are Oreo cookies, right? It's just together, they form together to be an Oreo cookie. But not individually. <laughs> this entire discussion is gonna give me a stroke. I can't do it. <laughs> Wait, my mic is apparently exploding. <laughs> you broke it. What? What? <laughs> Hello? There's no way. Can you guys hear me? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> what is going on? Biscuit. Right, well, thank it's a you, boys. Cookie. <laughs> Are all oh, is this biscuits, an argument? That's what I'm fucking saying! Are all biscuits cookies? Think about I that. I want you to... No, go Google that right okay, now. Go I'm, Google I'm that right now. this right now. I'm Googling this right now. Can I open this on stream? Hold on. Can I... Can I just... Hold on. Does this work? <laughs> if they're a cracker, would you put cheese on it? I would... Dude, Google. Oh, no. Are all... Are... All biscuits... <laughs> Cookies. Tomo is a college graduate in chemistry, by the way. <laughs> uh, uh, hold on. Um, okay, wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me just, let me just. Holy fuck. Let me just, let me just you know, we'll, we'll just. All right. In the U.S., cookies are flat round snacks made of sweet dough. In the U.K., these are generally called Biscuits, although people do call the bigger, softer kinds cookies, too. Fuck. Shit. What have I been doing my entire life? What? Yeah, this, this motherfucker said <laughs> Oreos are crackers. <laughs> oh, my God. What? No, but they're like cracker. I guess biscuit was more the word, but <laughs> but still. Okay, let me just rearrange this here. I, I, I hope you guys know that this isn't a bit. This is real life. Is it, uh, no, I... I <laughs> but they, they, they just don't feel like cookies. They feel more biscuity than cookies. Like, there's something wrong with this. No. What? Cookies can be crunchy. Cookies can be soft. There's all different kinds of cookies, but, dude. But biscuits aren't necessarily cookies, but... Dude, They're like different no, 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 words. At this point in time, no. Now we're okay. We're <laughs> we have devolved into a discussion about uh, like s semantics. At this point, we just need to establish Oreos or cookies, dude. <sighs> you know what? You know what? Fine. I'll. I'll just. But it, but it doesn't make sense because they're like. Are they made out of dough? Oh. The the hinging factor is oh that biscuits and cookies, are by the Google Oreos definition, are made, made out of dough. Out of dough? Are the Oreo crackers made out of dough? Are the Oreo crusts made out of dough? Right? Okay, here we are. I, I don't even know if I should keep continuing this. All I can say is that you can you can be as copium as you want to be. You can you can keep on telling wait. yourself lies. Wait. All you want. What? But all I'm gonna say is. I feel like everybody here has already like we we all understand the definition here that Oreos are cookies. They make it out of pie crust. Or oh, no, wait no. Oreo cookie cr 
what? crust recipe. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm looking what? up a recipe can't, right now. No, you can't say Oreo crust because that gives you an entirely different thing. Well, I just said, oh, okay, fine. Because Oreo... you need to remember, Oreos can be made into other things. For example, when you say Oreo pie crust, that's a pie crust made out of Oreos. That's different. Okay, what are Oreos made out of? Ingredient. Um... Unbleached enriched flour, what the- reduced iron? What the hell? Folic acid? This is not helping. Think- 12 things you didn't know about Oreo cookies by Insider. Okay, this has to be helpful. Uh, they're vegan and kosher. That's not helpful. What the- okay. Uh, That's the thing. Oh, I don't even know that. Um, I don't even know what kosher means. Ah, <gasps> ah! Uh, uh. Huh? What? Granulated sugar, flour, cocoa, water, and other ingredients are blended together in 2,000 pound tub. The batter is then thickened into a dough. No! 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 I did it, Chad. I fixed him. No! <laughs> I did it. I fixed him. It can't I won. be! It can't be! Uh, how is this even an argument? Bro, I don't even know. I'm I'm the one here and I don't even know. It can't be. No. There's no way. But it but it's like a cracker. But you you think you guys are struggling? I'm out here fighting for my life to make sure that this that the, 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 the truth is to be known here. Are a cracker is made out of dough now? What are crackers made out of? Oh my god. What what? Well, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are crackers made out of dough? Ah, uh, we can come back from this. We can come back from this cracker and crust gang. Okay. Are crackers made out of dough? What are crackers made out of? Um. Hmm. Ah, uh, yes. A cracker is a flat, dry-baked biscuit made with flour. Flavorings or seasonings such as salt, herbs, seeds, or cheese may be added to the dough or sprinkled on top before baking. So crackers are also made out of dough. What's to say an Oreo? And, and the, oh, crackers are also considered biscuits. But would you call a cracker a cookie? Eh? Eh? Would you call would you call a cracker a Not cookie? Not all cookies are crackers. Oh Lord. It is no longer the year of the rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> but cookies are sweet. Well yeah, well actually mm, But crackers un like unsweet cookies, I guess. I mean but like there are there sweet crackers? <laughs> I don't know. Sounds like copium. All right. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. But like, You've okay. Devolved. Okay. I will say the Oreo crusts are sweet, but I still think that's more biscuit territory rather than cookie. You know, it just doesn't feel right. It just doesn't sit right with me. I. I don't think there's anything to, to sit right or not. It's it's just the truth, dog. It it literally says or or like on the Oreo packaging is dead ass cookie sandwich. It it on God says cookie on the package. But like you take a bite out of the cookie sandwich, out of the cookie. Wait. No. But Oh no! Wait, no, you're no, right. No, 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 no. But right because now, it calls right it now, the sand, bro. But Oreo, the but the sandwich. But, uh, but you, 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 but you don't call a bread sandwich a bread sandwich. You just call it a sandwich, want, right? No, 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 no. That changes something. That changes something. No, we're, yes, we're, it you're, does. You're throwing it. No, you're throwing a definition. I want you right now to go and just Google dead ass okay, fine, Oreo fine. packaging. Okay, fine. That's it. Google. And I want you to look at the Oreo, first image. Oreo, Oreo, pack. I can't spell pack. Packaging. Milk's favorite cookie. Chocolate sandwich cookies. Easy open pull tab. Sealed. But, but, 
But like the whole thing together is a cookie. That doesn't mean like these parts are cookies, right? But, but it does say sandwich. It does say chocolate. Sandwich, chocolate sandwich. But like, but like it's not like a sand. But, but it does say chocolate. But like, a chocolate sandwich would be like the chocolates in the middle. So. But. It doesn't make sense. But it it's just uh, it doesn't have the. I would just like to let it be known, both chats. I have one, and that is all we need to establish. <laughs> it says cookie twice, but what are the <laughs> what are the tops of Oreos called? <laughs> no, say he common sense as one. <laughs> List of Oreo varieties. Oh, here this it is, is like Wikipedia. Watching, but steel Wikipedia. is heavier than feathers. Yeah, this is literally the equivalent of uh, oh, one kilogram of steel is 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 heavier than a kilogram of feathers. Okay, okay. Consisting of two cook two biscuits or cookie pieces. Fuck! No! We have literally, and I no joke, we we went on for maybe a, no. a good fifteen minutes, just just no. trying to establish and define Oreo cookie. Oh, God. Oh. Thank you. L plus ratio plus cookie. It's, it's just. How could this be? It. Just... I don't know, man. All I can tell you is your life is a lie. Buy gold. <laughs> I got nothing else. <sighs> well, at least three people, at least three people voted Cracker with me. So us three, aside from Minty's pity vote, stand in solidarity. End poll. End poll. <sighs> All right. All right. Hey man, that's just the way the cookie crumbles. Stop! You can't do this. To me. You can't do this to me. I just, it just it doesn't make sense. It just doesn't make sense. I just, Raven, you're a fucking genius. Dude. Oh my god. Uh, oh just, my god, that's fucking unreal. Uh, uh, Please tomo the national copium supply so I'm We're being thrown into copium debt. <laughs> just, it just doesn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> this is no joke. Almost 20 full minutes of uh, cookie copium. <laughs> uh, it doesn't. It just. Uh, <sighs> okay. I. Fine. The two crust pieces of Oreos are cookies. I admit defeat. I. It doesn't make sense, but, but I admit defeat. I, I know when I've been beaten, even if I can't agree with it. I know when the odds are stacked against me. There's no. I can't it's okay, chat. It's a cookie. We've rolled I can't him believe it's a and cookie. smoked him. I can't believe right. it's a cookie. It's so I don't think there's anything. To, there's, I don't think there's anything else to not believe. I think you. You just need to accept it. <laughs> I need to go to therapy, man. I, I need to go to therapy after this. It's... <sighs> I, I, it's, it's, it's just, it's just, it's just a cookie. It's, but, but it's not a cookie, but. I don't know what to say. I d 
I, I think I think we must lay the cookie down to rest. I I hate to say it. it. it it's I, time. It's time to let it go. I, I think you're right. I, the accident I just, wasn't I don't your wanna, fault. I, I don't it's not want your to. Fault. I just I I can't. I can't. <laughs> it's not your fault. <laughs> I, I just I I always thought it's just like it's like it's like a crackery. <laughs> I don't know anymore. So anyway, mushrooms. Uh, yeah, I, mushrooms. I think mushrooms are pretty good. I, th I think they're pretty good. Okay. Yeah. yeah mushroom, mushroom, okay. Mushroom, mushroom. No, five guys. Oh. Five guys, mushrooms in the burger. Mmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That good. Go into like a steak place. Yep. Yep. Sauteed mushrooms, red wine reduction. On the steak. That's where it's at. Yep. Yep. I agree. I agree. Hard smash. Not even a question. Smash. Smash. You, mmm. What other, well, there's also a, a, a portobello. What, what other like mushroom variations? Yeah, I mean, portobello. Portobello, pretty good. Enoki mushroom. Yeah. Oh, enoki. Actually, those so are good. the only. I, I, so good. Button, button, button. Uh, what are what, okay. something? Something button. Right. Right. Someone, 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 remind me because I can't remember. I don't know. Benjamin Button. Whatever. Like those are pretty good. What? No, not Benjamin Button. That's the guy with the movie. Anyways, white button, small button. Big button? I I can't remember. So, so I think they're unless they're just called button mushrooms. Those are pretty good. Yeah, too. button mushrooms. Pretty good. Honestly, I can't say shiitake. Good. Like, there's no variation. Yeah, I, with, like, honestly, there's not a lot of bad mushrooms. Right? Well, actually, well, the ones that kill you. Yeah, yeah, I kind of yeah, thought about that after. but like we're not smashing those ones, right? Like, I would hope not. I would hope. Well, not, okay, yeah. but for for the sake for the sake of this t list, it's like. It has to be edible, obviously. Right, so, I mean, right. I'm not saying I'm gonna smash like an inedible part of the coconut, right? Like, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go outside and pick out those like red top ones that are probably gonna kill me. Yeah, but, and like we'll see what ingest them. Yeah, I'm not like eating the colander of the Brussels sprouts in the Brussels sprouts picture. Like, I'm not eating the box of the Thin Mints, right? It's like, yeah, you know. Yeah, grill, grill their sautéed mushrooms. Yeah, you just you just can't go wrong. Like they're so versatile. There's so many different types that are edible that are good and they taste good. So it's just it's just good, you know. Mushroom jerky? I've never mm, heard of that. That's a, I mean, I feel like it'd still be good though. Like it just makes sense. Like I if mushrooms are good at a lot of things, like if they taste good in a lot of things, like I don't see why mushroom jerky would be bad. Like it just makes sense. I just filled apple juice on the Smash. Board. Okay. Smash. Yeah. Hard shell. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean. No. I, I lived no. off these. I lived off these in, in the college for quite a bit. I'm pretty I'm good. Passing. I, pretty good. I, I'm passing. Pretty good. I'm a Taco Bell lover, but like. Mm. Sorry. It's, it's just. Mm. If I'm going to get a taco and like I want a good taco. It's just a regular ass tortilla. It doesn't have to be hard shell. It's just a regular. Not, not soft shell, but it's just two tortillas. Meat, the onion, the cilantro. Mm. That's it. That's all I need. Okay, but the Doritos right. taco shells, the hard ones. Like, no, no? that's not even saving it either. What? That's, I'm not going to lie. That's novelty more than anything. <sighs> okay, but I will say the only thing unfortunate about these is when, like, the bottom, like, gets really soggy and your just taco just falls through the middle because it's just a thin piece of soggy, like, Yeah, taco. like, it, it just gets soggy and that's the problem. But, like, it's not going to stop me from smashing, you know? It's still good. Like, the crunch is still no, good. No, I, I wouldn't. I Even I wouldn't. Mm, ah, agree to disagree. I think these are pretty good. Hard shell is just not where it's at. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, uh, tomatoes. Oh, get the fuck out of my oh, sight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Smash. Sorry, I'm a Smash. hater. I'm a hater. Oh yeah. That's I, the, I that's despise the good stuff. tomato. That is so good. Oh. To raw to regular as tomato. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll, listen, I'll take mm -hmm. I'll take pizza sauce. I'll take tomato sauce. <sighs> I'll take fucking ketchup for all I care. But you have regular as tomatoes, like raw tomato. Out of my sight. This is Be the gone. this is the voice of a man who has never had a good raw tomato in his entire life. Ever. That is true, but also that will not change because I 
I, I absolutely hate tomatoes. I will get you good tomatoes one day, and I will force feed them even, to you, telling even, you it's an apple. You will never know. Even if it, you hand me a tomato and say, this is the best fucking tomato of your life, I will still you, stand I will, by my thoughts. I will literally force your mouth open and shove this inside. There is no... Tomato you, on burger is great, though? No! You, why? <sighs> because what... Okay. Okay, there is a good, burger, there's a good argument for that. Yeah. Okay, I think tomato on burger is is not good. Why? Because all it does is just make my burger soggy. And true. For what? True. It's like I true. don't. I don't. I am not here to just add like wet to my fucking burger. If Fair I'm going enough. to add anything to my burger, it either has to be a a flavor additive, mm -hmm. i.e. onions, or a texture additive, true. i.e. lettuce or raw onion. True. That's the entire purpose of adding more shit onto a burger. All tomato does is just sit there and be wet. I I actually agree with you there. And the worst thing is if you get like those tomato slices and they still have like some of the stem in them. I get those all too Ooh. often sometimes. And I'm just like, I'm eating and I bite into this thing and it's just a thing of like stem in my like commercial burger from fast food. And I'm just like, this is bad. Why is this here? I have to literally spit this out because I can't chew it and it literally tastes like I'm eating a piece of plant. So I'm a hater. But good tomatoes smash. For sure. There will there will not be a time where this changes my mind. I we both both of oh, I I this is my agree to disagree, but also I will I will not change. I will I will die okay. by this. Tomato and egg though. When you mix them together and you cook no, them even, really even hot. Then, even what? then. But it's so even sweet. Even growing up no, even growing up, like, Chinese food household, nope. What? Nope. No. Oh, my God. Okay, there's no fixing him. There's no saving I, him. I would, I would just eat the egg. I'm not even, I don't even uh, touch the tomato. Okay. 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 That, that's so, so I'm good. Hater. I'm okay. a hater. If you're not going to like it in that, you're not going to like it ever. That's I'm a hater. fair enough. You can hate. You can hate. All right. Green, like, the weird I, wine olives. I love oh. olives. <laughs> okay, I don't like these olives. That's a pass I for me. I like the sour, the sour, com not tomato. I, I love the sour olive. But when they have like the seed in them, I, I don't know. it's like that that video where the guy eats the watermelon seed and he like they play unravel and then he dies. Like you know that video? Oh yeah, the, the, the really weird. Like I don't even know. It's, it's like. Wasn't it like a film student's like final project or something? Like, <laughs> I think so. I could never tell if it was a joke or like an actual project. I uh, could be both. Could be both. But yeah, I. That's what I think of when I think of like the olives with the seeds. I don't like it. I, I just can't. I just can't. It's just too <laughs> salty. It's just too like. I don't mind, but I prefer black. I I think, I've slowly started to like the green olives. Like like that. It took yeah. me a long time too. I think maybe like when I was like middle school, I didn't like it. But like, I think during college, I was like, this isn't too bad. I just keep eating it. And I just keep eating it. I just, it's it, like pickles to me. It's it's like your take on white chocolate to me. It's just like you eat one and two. And after the third one, you're just like, this is too much. Like, oh. but like, I think it, so in this context, right? It's like you eat something super, super like, it's like salty slash savory. And right. it's like. Oh uh, yeah, and then you eat literally anything else, and then everything else just gets amped up, and that's why I'm like, <sighs> I don't know, I don't know. I mean, black olives, I will eat jars of those, no, no cap. I will eat like a whole jar of black olives by myself. But the green ones, like this one, is clearly like the green olive variety here, and I just, I just can't bring myself to smash. I, I'm a believer, you know. I, 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 I will, I will keep this. I would die by this. I, uh, agree to disagree. Agree to disagree. Anyways, sour cream, that's diarrhea town for me. I, mm, it, wait, wait, hold on. Hold on. Is, is sour cream dairy? I actually don't I know don't this, by know, the way. No, but I feel, like, I feel like it's always a gamble when I go for sour cream, and I'm not willing to take that risk. You know? Mm. It is dairy. Okay, no wonder. It is no dairy. Wonder. Okay, okay, okay. That I I think sour cream is very versatile, and I think that's the saving grace for it. Mm. But at the same time, I am not a very big fan of like sour cream in a lot of foods. Right, right, right. I mean, like it's a mid smash. It, it's like it's literally only used as an ingredient. But I I fucking despise it if it's like in my Taco Bell order. You know what I mean? Right, like, I right, right. Say. I feel like like very very marginal cases I will eat it, but most times if I have the option to pass, I will. So, you know, 
it's it's not death if I eat it, but mm. certainly a pass from me. Not I'm, enough. I'm of gonna a, pass just because I'm like. Yeah, not enough of a of a good experience with it. Okay, yeah. Okay. Junior mints. Uh, uh I haven't had these in a long time. Me so I, neither. I don't even have an opinion on these. Actually, same. Actually, should we just have a no opinion column? No, I know. No, okay, if, if you don't have an opinion, it's a pass. Yeah, true. Right? Well, it's like, you wouldn't you, you smash you someone you don't know. Exactly, but that, well, that's why you some pass people on it would, but not know. us. Yeah, exactly. It's un, yeah, like, un, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna try and go into that territory. That's a little dangerous. Yeah, I, know? I don't know. I'm. That's a safer option. Right, right, right. I mean, I like mint things usually, like thin mints. I mean, like chocolate mints, like pretty good. But I feel like, no, but I feel like that's different, right? Because right? I feel like these are like kind of like mint concentrated it's like something bit, specific maybe? you know yeah i i just don't I, know I enough guess. don't know enough yeah okay pineapple pizza this is the one this is the one you know where it's at you know where it's at this is where it's at boom top of the smash list that's so uh, good that's so good mm. so so let me mm -hmm. look i mm. i am changed but this is also because i don't have an opinion on Pineapple pizza. Oh? The thing being is like I've never, huh? I've never really cared about it for a long, long huh? time. I never cared about it. Oh my the god! The only reason that I, I do eat it now is because Lopkick, uh huh, uh, my mod and my like longtime friend, uh huh, uh huh. He he. Whenever we went out to go eat, whenever we ordered food together, uh huh, he would always get pineapple pizza. That's and I'm good. Like, you know what? Good. Yeah. And, and the thing being is like. I also because the, usually and because we're broke and in like in middle school we're right, like we can right. only get one pizza so it's like oh I'm like I don't you know he wants to get pineapple pizza I don't really care uh -huh. you know whatever I'll, I'll eat it right so over over the last like ten, year, ten, ten years ten years this is a story oh my gosh okay yeah, ten over the ten years that I've known him quite literally every single time we got pizza he always gets pineapple pizza. I just say, you know, whatever. Base. I'll, I'll eat it. Uh -huh. okay. So it, it's not that it's, I don't have anything against it, but also I won't go out of my way to eat it. You won't go you know out I mean? of your way to smash, but you'll smash if it's there. You know? Yeah, if it's there, I'll do it. Okay, whatever. fair enough. I will say my piece, I grew up with two flavors of pizza. You get cheese and you get Hawaiian. And what does Hawaiian have on it? Pineapple. So you eat it. How do you, it's good. How do you only have two? Like, well, that's, I mean, that's, uh, you you have to understand. I grew up living under a rock, right? You I know, know you this did. more I than did. anyone. <laughs> I, I live in a family, and we get two. Th we we have very limited food. I didn't eat Korean food until I was like in my twenties. Like, <laughs> I'm just saying. Like, uh, there are, I live with a very limited food spectrum growing up for reasons. Chad, if, if only you knew. <laughs> in, the, in the last year that we moved in together, you have. I have no idea the character arc he's gone through. <laughs> and I will say that pineapple pizza from day one, it was good. You know, Hawaiian, I was I never questioned it and I never will. I just always think it's a hit, you know? Pineapple pizza, Hawaiian pizza was invented in Canada. Huh? What? Okay, that's a yeah, weird one. Canadians very clearly knew how Hawaiian worked. Yeah, clearly. Very close to well, I mean. No, not very close to Hawaii. Anyways, you know, it was pretty good, though. It was pretty good. You put pineapple on it. You put bacon on it. Very good. I just got to say smash. It's, it's just the sweetness of the pineapple just mixes really well, especially with the ham on it. I mean, I wouldn't, like, take all the toppings off and only have pineapple on, like, dough. But I still think it's pretty good. Like, as long as you have some other toppings mixed in, like, you know, cheese and tomato sauce. So... Yeah, it's a pizza. Yeah, yeah, it's a pizza. At the end of the yeah. day, it's a pizza. Right, right. I'm not gonna pass pizza. Like, the only thing I'll pass is like, like super vegetable pizza. Like that. I'm just, I, I'm in it for the meat. Usually. I, well, actually, no. I, I will take super vegetable pizza really? now, now that I really think what? about it. It's like, it's like, okay. What you of all people? Yeah, uh, on pizza, if it's like spinach, red onion, regular onion, okay, olive, okay, okay, but not like I could do that. Broccoli, carrots, like ah, I, okay. Carrots, no. Broccolini, though, on pizza? Okay, that broccolini good, but normal broccoli? Bro broccoli, no. No, normal broccoli, too. If you if <gasps> you put it in, like, the small enough pizzas and you bake that, it's... Ooh. What? Oh, I, I was thinking, like, yeah. raw broccoli. Broccoli, broccoli, broccoli pizza's like, fire. Okay. I mean, like, peas, like, I don't, I don't know. Like, I just a little iffy for me. A little iffy. Artichoke on uh, artichoke? pizza? Okay. 
I haven't actually had artichoke on pizza, but I've yet. I I'm curious. I, mean, I feel I've like, wanted to try that. I feel like it's pretty good. I feel like that sounds pretty good. All right, mayonnaise. This mayonnaise is dog. I'm. I'm that's, I, a, that's a I, hard I, pass. I just pass. Like, this mayonnaise is dog. I mean, I have some. I'm in fridge, sorry, but, but American mayonnaise is is trash. It. it it's, you get QP mayo or bust. Otherwise, don't even QB? get me started with that, boys. I. I don't know. I mean, it's not like terrible, but I certainly won't like. I'll mix it with other things. But if I'm just eating it raw, it's bad. Like I, I'm not. I'm. I put it on my it's, sandwich. It's but... gotta be. It's gotta be the Japanese mayo, the QP mayo, right, the Japanese little mayo fucking baby on it. <laughs> the That's baby where it's at. Oh god. I did. Yeah, no, I'm not a hater, hater, but I'm just not gonna smash it. You know. Oh, I'm a hater. Okay. <laughs> Fuck mayo. Okay. Okay. You know. Is what it is. Okay, what's this? Black licorice? I no, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pass on that up. I've never I've never I'm not a big fan of licorice, period. Really? Oh, I used to eat like mm -hmm. Twizzlers and red vines all the time. That stuff was so no, good. No, I I can't. Oh my gosh. This is like my life fuel growing up. I was like just just oh yeah, just, the texture is great. It's just so like gummy. -y. It's just it was just good. I don't know. I like the flavor. I mean, okay, that's from coming from me though, who has like you know those lozenges I have, you know oh. uh, the, the super licoricey lozenges uh, that are like you know oh, okay. good for your vocal health. So, Become yeah, pro yeah, singer. So, well, we, had, we had to explain that a little bit. <laughs> okay, because okay. Fine. This motherfucker ordered like these like little like vocal health <laughs> lozenges and they taste disgusting. They're pretty good. I mean, I think no, they're pretty they're good. Gross. Ah. I cannot stand them. They are horrible. I mean, okay, compared to the Peapock Owl, it's like, it's pretty, it's, no, it's not the Peapock same. No, Peapock Owl is like, I can drink that out of the bottle Okay, not but, care. but that stuff's but good. Those, right? But like, yeah. I, I don't think but it's like, that bad. No, those lozenges are bad. No, I, 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 I don't know. Could be worse. I, I've had worse. I've had like fucking like mayonnaise, you know, and it could be worse, but... Ooh. I I still smash. I stand by that smash. Oh Ooh. man. Anyways, very good. Anyways, mint chip. Oh. I I like mint chip. I, uh, anyone can be like, it tastes like ice cream, but I think that's okay. Ooh. The best tasting ice cream ever created. It's the best thing on the market. This I'm, is I'm not crazy. Unmatched. I like regular ass vanilla. I'm actually super basic when it comes to ice cream. I what? will go to a place and just get vanilla. Oh God. I don't care. Uh, mint chip. Right? Oh, but, 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 hey, at the same time, mint chip. Mint chip's okay. I'm, you know, I'm not gonna. I won't pass. I will not pass. The most smashed I have ever smashed in my ever smash. This thing is. It's prime smashing territory. I don't know. I don't know if you've had the Baskin Robbins like mint chip, but that thing, that thing is my childhood. Every day after band concerts, you know, you have your concert with their band in middle school, and then you go over, you go to Baskin Robbins, you get the mint chip ice cream, and it's the best thing you've ever had. Like that's that's my experience with smashing ice cream. Like absolutely hands down. Love eating toothpaste. Would do it every day. Fire, fire. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm. Mm. People who describe it as toothpaste, I just, I, I'm, I'm a believer. You I think, think it's fine? Do you think I wouldn't eat toothpaste? I'll do it. I'll do it. It tastes good. I think it's good. Baskin Robbins average. Yes, but not their mint chip. Not their mint chip. Their mint chip hits. <laughs> hits, hits, hits. I, mm, it's been a while since I've been to Baskin Robbins. It depends on the place, I think. Yeah, to be fair, we don't go to ours because it's located in the sketchy area, and I don't want to hang around there at night. Our Baskin Robbins? I mean, we have a Baskin Robbins? It's right next to the wing stop. Oh, that's not that sketchy. I mean, it's by the McDonald's where people always get busted for you know what, so... No, that's the other one. Oh, wait, okay, that, that one. Yeah, yeah, we saw that happen. We saw that happen, yeah, that... so... <laughs> oh, my God, wait, you guys know that? Oh, my God. There was one night we were going to McDonald's. <laughs> And we were like driving by <laughs> and usually this McDonald's is pretty tame. So there's two McDonald's. There's one that's like like maybe like two minutes away. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And, oh, and that one that is one. like littered with people like sleeping outside. Uh -huh. And they like they will like knock on your car door. Yep. Yep. This other one is like in the parking lot, like across from like an IKEA. And it's like, okay, this is it's pretty good. It's pretty there good. There was one time where we're driving at like one in the morning because we we, we, go, we got the munchies. We're right, you know, you get hunger sometimes. And we no joke just see like two police cars outside <laughs> of the McDonald's. We're going through the drive-thru. 
<laughs> we get our order, we pull up around, and we see this dude getting arrested and put in the car. We're just like, what the hell is going on at a McDonald's at one in the morning? The worst thing is that wasn't the fir- that wasn't the only time we've seen it. I think we've seen it happen yeah. twice, <laughs> at least this twice. Happened to multiple times. Yeah, yeah. It's like, oh, what's going on? Another McDonald's arrest? Oh, yeah, you know, it is what it is. So that plaza scares me. That plaza scares me sometimes. I still got McDonald's from that same McDonald's today, but but still. <laughs> but still. It's not going to stop me, but it sure does scare me. I'm not going to go out into there just for, for Baskin Robbins, but I will for McDonald's, you know. Anyways. Anyways. It is what it is. <sighs> okay, whatever the hell these things are. Oysters? Scallops? Oysters? What are these? Smash. All right, pass. Smash. Seafood. I love seafood. I love oysters. I love oysters. Oysters with the, the what the fuck is it called? The slimy the, the, grossness. The, the, no, the, the sauce that you use. It's like shallots and like something else. Oyster it's sauce. Like sh- not vinegar. <laughs> well, it's not specifically oyster sauce. I can't. Uh, I can't uh, remember. Uh, uh, uh. uh sh- shallots. Shallot. Shallot. Oyster. Shallot. What's it called? Shallot. Mignonette. 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 Croissant. It's pretty good. Yeah. I love it. Croissant. Croissant. You know. Dude, I, just make it <laughs> no, they you know the sound that's just like, it, it, oh my god, it's like this, this lady who's like, it's like, today I'm going to eat a croissant. And then it's just a dude who goes, croissant. I love that meme. I love that. <laughs> croissant. Croissant. A croissant. 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 Tabasco plus a squeeze of lemon. Yes. Mm. Yes. I mean, that sounds pretty good not on oysters, but on oysters. It's, it's pretty good. Mm. I love oysters. Mm. I, I love seafood. I don't know. I just, I don't know how I feel about it. But, yeah, it is what it is. Seafood ick. Um, Asparagus. Smash. Smash. I mean, it's not bad, but it's definitely a Smash. Uh, it's smash because I think it's good at like steakhouses and I think yes. they've, they have done it yes. so well to a point where I am not a hater. I used to like think it was just worse green beans, but it really did grow on me after steakhouses. I will say, you know, yeah, yeah. it's just when done right, it's done right. But when done well, wrong, yeah, when it, it, not, like, not great. I think even from the few times that I've had asparagus, I think they've done it so well to the point where I'm like, eh, I'll mm, do it again. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think it's just an overall win. Overall, yeah, man. like it's the same. It's the same clause that I've had for uh, what the fuck was the other one? Uh, uh Brussels, Brussels sprouts. That was the one. Or beets? Yeah. yeah. No, it's, it's the same clause. It's the same clause for Brussels sprouts, where it's like I haven't had it done well enough to change my opinion of it. Uh, okay. I mean, but like you still put it at smash versus you you pass the Brussels sprouts. Yeah, like this is the one where I've had more oh. good experiences than oh, bad. The opposite case. Got it. Got it. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. All right. Is this tofu? I think it's, it's tofu because there's like soybeans. Oh, yeah, yeah. Smash. 100% smash. To- <sighs> what? Tofu, tofu is like a low smash for me. I'm not going to Really? Lie. This is I've, like... I've this never is really like, liked tofu. I love to- tofu. Oh, my God. I grew up with tofu dishes. Like, like it, it depends, in my opinion. Like, I... it. You gotta do tofu really well I mean, yeah. for me to like it. Otherwise, I'm just like, this is just soggy and weird. Oh, like the soft tofu with like some pork and rice and like and like soy sauce and stuff. It's it's just good. I don't know. I don't know what I could say. It's very good. Yeah, versatile. I, think, well, mm, I don't know. You. It, I think if you if no the the, chi- the Chinese chatters will get it. The smelly tofu. I love oh, I don't think I've tofu. had that before, actually. For fermented tofu is where it's at. Hmm, okay, okay, interesting. Especially when you go, like you get the the, the stinky tofu from like the night markets, though. Oh, those okay. are really good. I can't knock it because I haven't tried it yet. But I like, love stinky that, tofu. That sounds it, pretty good. It will good. assault you. It, it smells horrible. Oh, but damn! Is it good? <laughs> oh, okay. I, you know, I take your word for that one. Yeah. I mean, I will say there are limits with tofu. Like, I'm not gonna have the tofu, the tofurky, you know, the tofikin. I'm not really about the tofu substitutions. But when you're doing something for the pure like tofuness of tofu, that's where I am. That's where I'm smashing. You know, I'm not smashing the tofurky. Not here. All right. What is this? I hot don't sauce? know. I, Something gives is me it hot, hot sauce. sauce or like chili oil or I don't know. I'm gonna say hot sauce, and I, that's just a, sm- a, a pass because I have acid reflux. That's that's just it. it is what it is. Yeah, I'll die. I mean, I I'll do it, 
but I won't do it happily, you know. Pass. Wait, so so wait, we're saying this is we're saying this is hot sauce. I think we're saying it's hot sauce. Yeah, we're saying it's hot. If it's hot sauce, <clears throat> I'll say yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. If it's not, then I'll just say I don't know. Yeah. But for the sake of it being hot sauce, I'll say that's fair enough. Okay. Marmite and Vegemite. What the hell? I honestly, I've never had it. Never had it. I've had it once. I would not do it again. I cannot, in good faith, smash if I have not had it. To be completely honest, I'm a fake, fake we're, Australian. I mean, we're not Australian. I mean, so. I lived in Australia for a bit, but not. I mean, yeah, you, you, you had the opportunity I'm, to though. I'm, but. My honorary Australian license is revoked here. Uh, yeah, no, I don't know. Lastly. The peppermint patty. I hate it. I'm a hater. Whoa. Who? Really? I, I it it has such the, the peppermint like weird like it it's just such a weird texture. But I don't like it. This is literally my dad will go through an entire bag of these by himself. I I don't like the the texture of the peppermint, and it's like I can't tell if this is like a paste or if this is like whatever it is. It's just like this is not what I expect out of this this snack. I mean. By my normal standards, I honestly would pass, but because I've just been conditioned growing up, I have to smash. I just, it's just, it's a nostalgia food for me. It's just, it brings back too many good memories, but I can't smash on the flavor alone, to be honest. It's like a nostalgia smash, you know? Yeah. Fine. Fair, fair, fair. Yeah. You'll get a yeah. nostalgia factor points, yeah. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we'll we'll take it. I, I I I there's no saving in my book. I I can't do it. Mm. You know what? I respect that. As someone who's not a fan of the flavor, but only smashing for the memories. Yeah, yeah, I'll give it to you there. <sighs> okay. So that's that that's that's our list. That's our list. Jesus. That's our list. Screenshot it here. Woo! This is this is the list. Yeah. Uh, I'm scared to screenshot because it kills my computer sometimes. I'm gonna hope. Yeah, doesn't. I'm just gonna leave it open and end the stream. <laughs> All right. Here, here you go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wait, you can download. I don't want to yeah, accidentally click download. something. So. Uh, well, whatever. I can take a screenshot later. Yeah. Care. Yeah. Same. Same. All right. Well. Cool. I I think we're done. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. I didn't. Wow. That that was. To, to be fair, <laughs> maybe half an hour of this was dedicated to one thing. Okay, but yeah, I have no excuse. I mean, I, I, what can I say? Like, yeah, that, I mean, that was you. I, that was all you. I, I honestly, that that blindsided me. I just didn't expect it. I, I still am not over it yet. It still kind of hurts. <laughs> Every was good except the cookie bit. You need to understand that that wasn't a bit. <laughs> <laughs> you, you guys you guys think that was a joke but that was just us genuinely i, I actually them. i actually thought it was like a cookie i mean not a cookie a crust like a cracker oh. <laughs> it's copium boys it's copium uh, i legitimately legitimately with all my heart oh my god i uh, listen i i i'm glad that i'm here to to show him the, the light but also god damn it. yeah <laughs> It is what it is. It is what it is. Well, I'll get it. I'll get it back someday. I will. I maybe I'll try and get hired by the Oreo company, the Nabisco, and see if they can change their labeling because it just it just doesn't sit with me. It just doesn't sit well with me. I don't know. Damn! I can't believe you're gonna become a nutritionist. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure. I'm sure they hire. I'm sure they hire chemist, chemistry engineers. Sure, surely, point. surely. It's right. like it's like how alcohol companies do it. Right, 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 right. I applied to a few of those. Didn't get them. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Anyways, um well, thanks thanks for coming everyone. Thanks for thanks for thanks for joining Sagus. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for humoring me on this idea. That I, thought, <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was thought it was pretty funny. It's okay. Eventually eventually we'll we'll have more than just tearless streams. Yes. You won't know what's coming yeah, until we, it's hit we, you we won't we won't ever let you know what's gonna happen maybe it'll come next week maybe it'll be two months maybe it'll be an until whole whole last year you never many know many years maybe it'll be yeah. event eventually next lifetime you never know like death in, even in death do we not part i don't know how that works <laughs> I, I don't know we'll, we'll we'll figure out another game mm. it, it, alternatively we teach him how to play valor <laughs> fuck <laughs> oh my no, god no learn, no have, learn. <laughs> you guys have not seen me play valorant this man is like one of the few people who has seen me play valorant multiple times 
every time I'm like, Who, wh what's this button do? <laughs> oh my god, I got the guy! They're like, Tomo. I, I, you guys <laughs> you do it? don't understand <laughs> just what goes on in our game. <laughs> <laughs> the time when I, oh I'm like, oh, what's this do? Oh, oh I'll throw the wall down. Why did you do that? What are you doing? <laughs> God, I don't the, even. The legendary sage. The okay, legendary anyway, you gotta, sage. You gotta end. Yeah, I gotta I'm, end. I'm gonna go play Valorant. I'm gonna go pass out. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. Honk, honk, shoo. Good honk, night. Shoo. Me, me, me. All right. Uh, me, me. Thanks for coming, gamers. I'll see you all on the next stream. I'm Uzuki Tobaya, and this guy is. Soggy. Thanks for coming to our food <laughs> deal list. If you like the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and also follow Arakita Sigi on Twitch. He's Sigi underscore. Ch and uh yeah <laughs> yeah and go go check him out he's gonna go play Valorant right now i'm gonna link his thingy in the chat uh go raid siggy yeah pin message Boom. all right sick all right cool <laughs> i'll see you guys on the next one all right oh two gamers oh two brother oh two brother all right bye later dude what is up guys thank you so much for watching before you go be sure to leave a like comment and subscribe we're almost to 100k subscribers so if you could hit the bell and share i'd really appreciate it i post every wednesday thursday and friday so i'll be sure to make it worth your time all right that's all my dudes remember as always love peace and weed